When I was in third grade, one of the things that I vividly remember from childhood is we were going on a field trip to the zoo and I was adamant that I took a first aid kit with us and my mom was like there's no need there's plenty of staff there somebody's gonna have one like you don't need to take that with you and I was adamant I had to have one it had to go with me and I wasn't gonna take no for an answer so finally she gave in and I took one of the small little first aid kits with some band-aids and stickers and a couple of suckers and just carried it around and watched as we went through the zoo. Well, lo and behold, somebody fell and skinned their knee. And I was like so excited, not that they had gotten hurt, but I was actually gonna get to be able to use the first aid kit. Got them a Band-Aid, got them a sucker, got them a sticker, and that was just like the highlight of my entire trip to the zoo was the fact that I got to take care of somebody with my first aid kit. And that, kind of is always where I reflect back to when I think about why I ultimately became the student to become a nurse is I love the feeling that I got when I got to help someone else. I realize that the satisfaction and happiness that I get from helping others, explaining to families and patients, making them feel comfortable, making them feel safe, um, was actually doing something for myself and it kind of sparked an interest. Oh, that is, you know, that is something that's a possibility. Most people out of high school go directly onto college and pursue a career. I did not. Instead of learning then living, I wanted to live and then learn. So I feel like I'm a little late to the game as far as finding a career, but my reality of it is being able to show not just my daughter but my son as well that it's never too late to get into something and find what you really love to do. Never stop learning. There's always something new. There's always things that are changing and being able to kind of keep up on that just kind of keeps me focused.